Okay, you guys, so I am a huge Hot Topic fan. So I recently ordered some Hot Topic items that I had got from a um, Hot Topic gift card for Christmas. Thanks to my girl, Saf, Sapphire, Gianna's mom, who I really, really love. Um, yeah, so thank you, Saf. You got me this shirt. It's a, an Ewok shirt that says Nub Nub. Now, I've heard that they technically are not called Ewoks. Um, I don't know how they just immediately just got the name Ewok, but I did hear um, that their technical name for themselves are not Ewoks. I don't know how the name Ewok just got stuck on them, but it did. But yeah, technically this isn't an Ewok. This isn't an Ewok, but I think they're cute. When I saw it on the website, I had to get it. And also, I got these little ears. I love them. Aren't they cute? Don't you just love? <laughs> I've always been, I've, ugh, I can't talk, you guys. I always get tongue-tied. What the freak? I've always been such a huge fan of Hot Topic ever since high school. So, yeah, my mom would always, like, whenever we would make like a, a trip to the mall, we would always go to Hot Topic. That would be like one of our um, main stores to go to and she would um, buy me like a bunch of stuff from there. She just really, really cool mom. But yeah, I like these ears. And this is basically like a, a Hot Topic, Hot Topic little, um, what do you call it? Um, haul but instead of showing the clothes right out of the bag, I'm wearing it. <laughs> I also got another t-shirt from Hot Topic. It's uh, Lady Gaga, but um, it is in the room and I really don't want to go in the room because Anthony's in there taking naps. So yeah, I'll show you guys that shirt a little bit later. <sighs> but yeah, that's what this little outfit is, Hot Topic. Fashion. So I recently signed up for the let go app pretty much you just Donate all your clothes and you put them on the app and then you put a specific price of each item of clothing that you want to sell it for and Yeah, you just wait for buyers to buy your stuff and that's what this bag of clothes is so um, Actually correction you don't donate it uh, <coughs> You um <laughs> You uh, you sell your clothes you don't donate them but um, yeah, so that's what this bag of clothes is for. So if you guys want to buy my stuff on Let Go, I will put um, my username on the Let Go app and I will maybe see if you guys wanna buy my stuff. This is just one of um, the many other bags of clothing items that I wanna sell. So yeah, dinner time. So I'm not really that hungry, so I just decided just to make myself a tuna sandwich on sourdough bread, my favorite, with some apple cider and some water. Oh my god, you guys. Did you guys ever have this specific cup growing up? Um, I always used to drink out of these cups when I was little. My mom, I think, had like two or three of them. Um, for me when I was growing up and the straw I swear I don't know why I did this but the straw was always like chewed on or whatever I guess I would chew on the straw and you see how it's like perfectly round at the tip <laughs> um, but um, the part of the tip of the straw when I was growing up it was like I think open and broken or whatever um, yeah I guess I used to just chew on it but yeah these cups actually made a comeback, I guess. I got it over at Dollar Tree. And, yep, pretty, pretty, uh, what's that word? Um, euphoric? No, not euphoric. Ah, what is that word where you're, like, reminiscing about the past and it's, like, good memories? Nostalgic? Yeah, there you go, very, uh, pretty nostalgic. Don't we just love the Valentine's Day hearts all over the walls? So cute, right? Oh, and over here. So cute. Just in time for Valentine's Day. So excited.
what up my T-Rex fam um, now I can actually sit down and talk to you guys um, okay so yesterday it was so funny you guys want to hear some tea um, it's actually it's not really tea more of like story time oh my god I just thought of something okay I am a little bit distracted right now okay just thought of the most perfect idea so okay wait a minute this is perfect okay so you know how I'm calling you guys my T-Rex fam or like team T-Rex I think for every time I want to do like a story time video or like tea time video, you know, like what's the tea girl, spill the gossip, I'm going to call it T-Rex time, you know, like T-Rex and I'll have like a little emoji with a T-Rex. Oh my God, that'll be so cute. Oh my God, that'll be cute. Okay, I think I'm going to just do that. So each time I have a video <clears throat> that has to do with story time or a little bit of like tea. I will I will title it on the bottom and then I'll put like T like T-Rex time or something like that. I'll 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 think of something. Yo girl got it. Anyway, so yeah, yesterday um it's T-Rex time, you guys. <laughs> so, yeah, yesterday um I had an eye doctor appointment, okay? So I usually go see my eye doctor at least for me I think every year just to get like a checkup to see if my vision is doing good and just you know just to get like an all-around you know checkup so I did that yesterday and it was so weird because I've never got my eyes dilated ever and my doctor she was like yeah I'm just gonna dilate your eyes and you know that way we could you know see the inside of your the inside of your eyes the inside of your soul <laughs> and so I was like all right it's cool I'll get my eyes dilated whatever not knowing what was gonna be ahead of me I got my eyes dilated <sighs> it was very very interesting very very weird I'm telling you I feel like I temporarily went blind for about an hour and a half. It got so bad, I couldn't even, okay, so I'm jumping ahead of myself. So she dilated my eyes, she put, I'm pretty sure who, like you guys have ever gotten your eyes dilated, you'll, you know, you'll know what happens or whatever. Me, not me, I'm, I'm new to this. So yeah, I got them dilated. She put one, one set of eye drops in and it kind of, it didn't sting or burn or whatever, but it had like a little tingly feeling. So then she put another set of eye drops in, kind of like just to numb it. And <laughs> that was the most weirdest sensation ever. I literally felt like my eyelashes were sitting on my eyeballs. I even told, um, I even told Savannah, cause Savannah went with me. Um, I was like, I feel like my eyeballs are giant. I feel like, no, not my eyeballs. I feel like my eyelashes are like, growing giantly and sitting on my eyeballs <laughs> and she just like looks at me and she was like really like you're weird um but yeah it felt really really weird I don't know what happened but so I'm laying there on the seat because she had to leave the the doctor had to leave to go and assist with another patient so I'm just laying there just looking around thinking I'm blind I can't see and okay, I'm not literally blind. I could still see, but it's very, very blurry. And <laughs> I put my glasses on. And so it's weird because you would think with your glasses on, you'd be able to see better. No, for me, that wasn't the case. I put my glasses on. Whoa, I could not see to save my life. So <sighs> I texted Anthony. And when I looked at my phone with my glasses on, I couldn't see my phone I couldn't see the letters, I couldn't see what I was texting or whatever. And so I took them off and the weirdest part is I was able to see better without my glasses. I don't know. It was really, really weird. So then the doctor comes back in and she's like, how are you doing? And I'm like, uh, okay. <laughs> and I'm like, can't see anything it's really weird and she's like oh yeah that's fine that's normal I'm like no no it isn't <laughs> it's not normal 
<laughs> it was so funny. Oh, I wish I would have vlogged it. I, that would have been like the funniest vlog ever. Um, but yeah, I didn't think about vlogging because I was too busy trying to see you guys. Okay. Um, but yeah, so she was like, okay, the, the, the blurry vision will last like a few hours. And I'm like, few hours, what do you mean? But yeah, and she was right. It did last only a couple hours. But as I was leaving, um, what do you call it? The, I think the, the secretary or whoever answers the phone, the, um, the receptionist, she's like, all right, like, you know, did you have a good visit? I got to pick up my glasses. I'm getting brand new glasses next week and brand new sunglasses. So I think I have to go next week to go pick them up. So hopefully I'll be able to um, vlog that little trip. But what I have in my hand right here, these are the shades that they told me to wear when I go outside to go back home. And I thought, no, I wouldn't need those. It's fine. And then the receptionist was like, okay, that's cool. Yeah, it doesn't really look too bright outside. I think you'll be fine, but just take them just in case. So I literally go outside <laughs> and thinking, you know, I'm like, I'm going to be cool or whatever. I don't need these little plastic looking sunglasses. And I'm not wearing them because they're very, very uncomfortable. So I'm just showing them to you guys. Yeah, that's what these are. I'm pretty sure you guys that have had your eyes dilated recognize these bad boys. Looks kind of cool. Um, but yeah, so I go out there thinking that I'm going to be all cool, like I don't need them, you know, my eyes are good, no girlfriend. I go out and I'm like, what? <laughs> my eyes hurt. I can't see anything. Oh my God. No. <laughs> I literally, Savannah's like, um, she's pushing me back to her car because I didn't take my motorized wheelchair. I took my, my manual wheelchair. The one where like I literally have to be pushed. So Savannah's pushing me. I'm literally looking at the cement at the at the um the sidewalk because I cannot see for for crap. I can't see at all. It was so weird. And I'm just like, I'm blind. <laughs> it was so funny. Oh my god, it was crazy. So I put these on in the car. And as soon as I put them on, I'm like, oh, okay. That's that's a lot better. And Savannah's just like, oh my god, you look like, I don't know, you look like you've had LASIK eye surgery. And then, no wait, no, I said that. And then Savannah just starts laughing. I'm like, I look like I just had LASIK eye surgery. It's so weird. And I'm like, how do I look? Do I look cool? <laughs> and she's just like, you look weird. But yeah, so that was that was a day. That was an interesting day, you guys. And oh, so I come home. Anthony's waiting home for me. And so I come back and um what do you call it? He's leading me back to the house. By that time I'm already in this wheelchair. And I'm thinking that I'm okay to drive my chair my own like by myself. But I almost literally crash into a car, a parked car. I literally almost crash into the stairs. <laughs> I almost crashed into the pole, to the to the to the lamp in the living room. Girl, I could not see still. Oh my god! The doctor told me, "Oh, it'll be good for like in, for like a couple hours. You'll have blurry vision, but it, that's the only that's that's how long it lasts. Just like a couple hours." And I'm just like, "Babe, I can't see you." <laughs> it was just so funny. Um, but yeah, that was my day yesterday, you guys. I don't know. If you guys ever had your eyes dilated and if you did have them dilated did you guys have that same experience <sighs> yeah <laughs> that was my t-rex time um, uh, moment for you guys um, but yeah it was fun now next time every time I have to go to the eye doctor I will be prepared and not to wear makeup also because I wore makeup, you guys. I'm such an idiot. Because I didn't think that they were going to have to put water drops in my eyeballs. So by the end of the doctor visit, um, my eyeliner was like creasing on my eyelids. Um, it was just bad. Luckily, I didn't wear mascara because that would have been even worse. But yeah, so next week, 
I get to pick up my new sunglasses and my new glasses um, and be brand new. New year, new glasses, new shades. <laughs> but yeah, so um, I think, what else do I talk about tonight? I think I'm going to maybe end the vlog here or continue it tomorrow. I don't know. No, I think I'm just going to end the vlog here with this little T-Rex time. T-Rex time. And I will see you guys tomorrow in the next video. Please like and subscribe. Um, yeah, turn on your bell notifications too. So you guys are no uh, notified every time I upload. And I will see you guys tomorrow in the new vlog. I will be with Jacqueline, so I'm not really sure what we, what we will be doing. But for sure I will be going to church. And maybe I can vlog that a little bit. But yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next vlog. Alright, kisses. Bye!